Hey, I want to tell you guys this. Thanks so much for joining me again this morning. Uh, we're getting ready to go and see if we can locate these crappie in the trees, okay? Brush piles. I'm going to show them to you on the screen. And then we're going to catch them. Very simple fishing. A little 1.5 inch jig, a little tube, and my 10 foot yank stick. I want to tell you what I did this morning. I got to lower my voice because it's very early, 6.30 in the morning. It's raining. It's raining right now. I have my boat loaded up, ready to go, right? Getting ready to film for you guys. Looked up, forgot my camera. Had everything. You can see the 10-foot yank sticks. You can see my camera. I got it covered with a plastic bag. Actually, the harness, the holder. And I forgot the camera. I do that all the time because I'm excited about fishing. Ever since I was a little boy, I'm just like you guys. There ain't no difference. Look, this is, look, this is my 10-foot boat. Guys, there ain't nothing special about me. Look, you can see my electronics. I don't have one of those big old screens like everybody else has. I just got that little portable thing, and it's about nine years old. Um, and we're getting ready to get on the lake, and we're gonna see if we can catch some crappie, okay? So we're, 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 not, we're not on a meat run today, officially. We may put a few in the basket and then film for Instagram. And by the way, if you guys get a chance, my Instagram followers are on fire. Follow me on Instagram at Cam's Crappy Hole Apparel. I'll have it written right on the screen so you see it. But anyway, thanks for joining me, guys. Let's get on the boat and let's see if we can have some luck. And you're going to follow it with me, okay? And I'm gonna, we're going to follow it all the way out. We're going to fish this. And I want, I'm going to kind of slow down because I want you guys to see it. And plus, I'm going to show it to you on the screen. Look how far it goes out. Okay, I remember when this tree fell. We're still at the base. We're still at the base. We're still at the base. Okay, unequivocally, I know for a fact that the crappie are hiding out. They're hiding here. If you ever see structure in the water like this, I don't care what time of the year it is, the crappie are there. Okay, I'm in four feet of water right now. Look at that. See those branches in there? That blue dot in there signifies those are crappie. They're sitting in there unequivocally. Don't, don't second guess yourself. I'm going to let you guys see it. And then we're, I'm going to show it. To, I'm gonna, we're going to pull some out of here. You guys can see that? Look at that. Okay, I'm gonna show it. I'm gonna show it to you on top of the water. Then I'm gonna show it to you on the screen. Look at that. Look how it's holding crappie in there. Water temperature is 80 degrees. It's dropped. Look at those crappie in there. Look at them. Those are big boys too. Okay, they may not be active. Okay, it may be just the small ones are active. You see how far? Let me show you how far we out. We're out now. Look at that. You see how far we out here? Look at that. Look at all these crappie down in there. Some down on the bottom may be catfish, they may be big carp. But right there, suspended, those are crappie. Okay, you guys see that? I'm in 13 feet of water, but look what the magic, the common denominator is. The number, six foot, seven foot. You see that? Seven feet. You have to figure out what your magic number is on your body of water. Let me show it to you. Let me give you a good eye level. Okay, look at that. That's what we're looking for. Now watch this. I'm going to pass right over these branches right here. I want you guys to get a good look at it because we're going to be fishing this with that 1.5 inch tube. Okay, look at that. Seven feet. Four feet. Look at that. Nine feet. Look how close we are to the branches. You see that? Look how close we are. Look at the numbers again. Six feet. Seven feet. Seven feet. Uh -oh. we dropped one of our plastics in the water look at that see that six feet six feet that's why you guys I'm, I'm always yanking them at six feet look look we're right on top of them so listen all we have to do I gotta lower my voice because I get excited all we're gonna do is just with our yank stick with our 10 foot yank sticks we're just going to pull out six and a half feet of line with that pink white and chartreuse tube look at that five feet six feet nine feet they're, they're all, they're, look, they're stunning right down there. And it's our job to pull them out. You have to figure out what color plastics that they're interested in. For me, with my cams kit, I know I got the four hottest colors in there. I got the red, black, red chartreuse. I got the pink, white, and chartreuse. I got the uh, orange, white, and chartreuse. And I got the green, black, and chartreuse. All of them come with that nasty bin hook in there. Okay, now, look how far we're out now. Okay, we're past the tree. Now look where we are. Okay, you don't see anything on the screen. Nothing. Look at that. The tree is behind us. 
So unequivocally, you know these crap here right here. You don't have to say, do not second guess yourself. Let's get in there and let's see if we can have some luck, okay? Listen, make sure that you have that finger, that, that line underneath your fingers. It gives you more feel of what's going on with that jig while it's in the water. Okay, even though your rods, are, these cams, nasty, uh, uh, yank sticks are sensitive, you still want that. You still want, look, look at that. Oh man, time we lowered it in the water. Now let me say this, each time that I get a, a bump or I get hooked on something, I have to bring it back up to make sure that that jig sits this way horizontal in the, in the water column. That's very important. Always pay attention to your jig. Sometimes you're going to have them, they're just going to be nipping at the, at, at the butt of it, okay? Let's get back up there. Let's see what happens. Remember, I got my line stretched out to about six and a half feet. Look at that. There he is, Yank. There he is. Look at that. Guys, how long I was in the hole? Just for a second. Just for a second. That's that pink, white, and chartreuse with that nasty bend hook. Okay, let me tell you what you do. You lower your, your, your print in the water because it's summertime and you catch, that's a good eating crappie. You catch about 20 of those, you got a meal. Okay, we're going to put them in the basket. We're not going to keep, but we're going to put them in the basket because we're going to show for Instagram. Okay, we're going to release them if I can find my basket. Each time that you feel a bump or you get hung on a log, make sure, let me see, let me see if I can turn you guys. I'm doing, I get, I get excited just like a little kid. And that feeling never goes away. That's what keeps me coming back fishing. Okay, make sure that that plastic is all the way up on that collar. You can see I'm running the number four hook. Okay, if I feel this hook and I get stuck on branches or I catch more than a few fish, I want to make sure I test this hook to make sure it's super sharp. Because if it's not super sharp, I'm taking it off and I'm putting on another one. Okay, that's how it sits in the water, co the water column. I got it in the pink, white, and chartreuse, guys. And we're going to get back up there. Look, here's six, let me show you this. I'm marked at six feet, but I'm running about six and a half right now, okay? Make sure you put that line underneath that EVA grip. You can see I extended, the, by the way, I didn't even introduce you guys to my cams 10 foot, matter of fact, let me turn it around, to my cams 10 foot yank stick, okay? It's pure carbon fiber. And let me tell you what I did, which, which, which I'm so happy about. Normally, whenever you have a rod, the EVA grip, the butt of the grip isn't that long, but I extended mine. If you're trolling, these will go into any rod holder. And by the way, I'm going to do a cutaway so I can get into the details. I'm, I'm trying, I know I'm giving you guys a drink of water with fire hose because I'm trying to get back up there real quick. But I want you guys to make sure that you understand that with my finance company, when you guys come and you check out at camscrappyhole.com, when you check out, I'm going to offer you up to $600 line of credit to spend in my store. Okay, over time, once we get to know you and you've paid your $600 line of credit off, and all you do is check out like you normally do, okay, with your debit card or your credit card, no interest, no credit check, okay? And what my finance company is going to do after pay, they're going to break, let's say this rod is, 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 is $100. They're going to break this up into four payments for you guys, okay? I can afford a million dollar house if you give it to me for $200 a month. Okay, we're going to break this up into payments for you, four bi-weekly payments. So at the end, by the time you get finished paying for this rod, all you pay is $100. You're not paying $125, $130, all that interest, just $100. And once you pay your first installment of $25, we're going to ship your rod to you free. Shipping's free, no interest, no credit check, and you guys, the rod is on its way to you. Let's get back up there. I'm going to tell you a little bit more about it once I do a cutaway. Let's get back up there to get out of that goat trail of just doing the same thing each year. You'd be surprised of the ways you can catch fish. And listen, this is just like old school cane pole. All I'm doing is just lowering it in the water. I'm not reeling at all. Let me back up a little bit. The wind has picked up big time. Notice when I go from one spot to the other, I pick that jig, oh, that yank, all the way up out the water. Look at this little rascal. Look at this. We know we got some big ones down there. We know we got the big one down there, unequivocally. Well, guys, we're after the numbers. Let me show this one to you, okay? He was probably born about a year and a half ago. You better be careful, little rascal. Let's release him. Hey, we should have put him in the basket because we're filming. Yank! Come 
stone out of there. <laughs> oh, he dropped right in my lap, too. Look at this. He dropped right in my lap. Okay, let's put him in the basket. We're going to film this for Instagram. We're going to release him, but we want to film. I'm so used to letting fish go. The last one, I let him go as well. I'm so used to it. 99% of the time, I'm letting fish go. Guys, this is really and truly very, very similar to using the cane pole. Very similar. I need to do a cutaway to show you guys exactly what I'm using. And I, I, this is important. I've graduated from the stage of um, cutting one pole, retying, and putting another color jig on there. I have two poles, okay? You can see this one and you see the one behind me. Both of them are 10-foot Cam's Yank Sticks. Matter of fact, let me show it to you. Okay, they're pure carbon fiber, guys. And these rascals here only weigh equivalent to a pair of two household scissors. Okay, just the, the, the rod by itself. And I want to say this to you guys because all of my rod and reels come with, come with a reel. Okay, they're just not a rod by themselves. All right, they're totally counterbalanced. So that means that if you're on the water jigging for five or six hours, you don't get tired because it's super light, okay? And I want to mention to you guys, when you grab this pole, grab by the end. Don't grab here and jig. Grab here. This way you're only carrying just the rod. You're not carrying the reel. All you're really using this reel for is just to hold line so you can pull out, okay? It's starting to rain a little bit, drizzle, so I thought this would be a good time to do a cutaway. On this pole, I got the black, red, and chartreuse with that uh, 116. Number four, nasty bin hook, red, black, and chartreuse. They're tubes, okay? Let me put this one down. And I want to show you, this is what, I, what you guys have been seeing me catch with right now. I'm getting ready to put a new one on because they have been just gnawing on it. Okay, so I have to replace it every two or three fish. Matter of fact, while I got you here, I'm going to show you how I put it on. This is a 1.5 inch tube. You can see the, the bristles on the tail. And all I do is take that hook center it right down the middle I hope you guys will be able to see this I'm not really sure if you can or not okay if the fish are not that aggressive I'm gonna bring it out right at the tip okay let me show it to you boom normally I come out about three quarters let me turn it upside down so you guys can see it push it up on the collar and if you don't want the collar we have hooks nasty bin hooks without the collar okay you see that now, if they're, if they're not aggressive, I will bring it out almost near the tail, almost near these, these chartreuse bristles. But these guys are, are, are fairly aggressive, so I'm, I'm okay with that. And I make sure that, it's, that my knot lets that jig hang in the water column like this. Okay, that's very important. So anytime that I bump a tree or anytime I catch a fish or I feel a bump, I got to check this jig to make sure it's proper um, sitting in the water column. Okay, that's very important. And by the way, since I want to, uh, I, I got you guys here, let me show you that. A lot of people have asked me, Cam, how do you do your jigs? Let me let that just kind of float a little bit. Um, I wanted to show you guys that. And if you get a chance, you'll see it in the right left-hand corner. Go to Facebook, Cam's, Cam's Crappy Hole Community. Okay, so that way you guys can, it's a, it's a free site we, we started. We got over 1,000 members in there. We started about five, six months ago. And that way you can showcase your fish, what you catch all around the world. You can showcase it, okay? You'll see it down here in the corner, Cam's Crappy Hole Community on Facebook. All you have to do is answer a couple of questions. It's free of charge. You know, what type of fish you catch, how'd you hear about us, boom, we let you in, okay? So I'm using a 10-foot Yank Sticks, guys. Let me get a drink of coffee. Mmm. And we're going to give them time to settle down, plus it's raining. And this would be a good time to do that. I got the fish in a basket, but I'm on a film for Instagram. I'm not going to keep them. Um, you heard me mention on there about, a, about my finance company. Okay? I want you guys to go in there and take advantage of Afterpay. I will give you up to $600 credit line to spend in my store. Okay? And once we get to know you, build a relationship, I'll up that from $600 up to $2,000. Okay? Plus free shipping. Just go to camscrappyhole.com. We have one of the largest selections of plastics across the country, and we're probably in the top two of ultralight rod and reels around the country, probably in the world. Fall is getting ready to set in. The fish will notice that, the, that, that fall is here. 
right over there at crappy point you guys saw my last video that we were stacking 12 13 14 15 inch crappy they're already detecting it okay we're in august now okay in october i'm trolling i'm going to be using all of my signature series plus i'm going to be using my nine foot cams yank stick on the left and the right so i'll be running a total trolling of seven poles okay by the way i didn't show you guys our new twisted tumbler okay this is my cams twisted stainless steel tumbler it keeps things hot and cold for six to seven hours okay you know i got coffee in here hmm you can follow us on youtube on facebook and also on instagram okay which i'll be shooting these fish for here here shortly so if you guys get a chance everything in my store i finance it through afterpay everything okay including a pack of hooks for ten dollars plus free shipping one click two click put it in your cart and you're on the way my yank sticks my nine ten foot all 68 of my uh 60 of my ultralight rod and reels all, everything's on afterpay okay so you can load up for fall if you don't feel as if you deserve it nobody else will if you don't treat yourself nobody else will treat you so listen i'm going to try to get back out there it looks like it's start, starting to let up a little bit we're running the pink white and chartreuse if they get complacent with this pink and white i'm going to switch i'm going to go to that black red and chartreuse okay all of that comes by the way mm, go on the site these are available right now. I think we have like 11 different types. We've got a 36-ounce uh, water bottle. we got a flask. Um, the twisted tumbler here. Um, we got a, a coffee mug, a travel coffee mug. All, everything in there is stainless steel. we got a his and her package in there. Plus, we got a giant water bottle with a yank on it. You got to see what you go and go, Just go to Cam Scrappy. we got too much stuff, guys. I know you guys say I sound like an infomercial because we got so much stuff. Okay, and by the way, for you guys that's been with me a long time, we're getting ready to head to greener pastures. For you guys that have been supporting me and showing love, I'm getting ready. You're getting ready to show. I'm getting ready to show you exactly where your money is going. Okay, for you guys that have been with me since day one. Okay, listen. Let me put this coffee. Get one more sip of this coffee, and I'm gonna show you guys the kit. This is the kit that you will get. Hmm. Hmm. You can go on the Cam's Craft Store, or you can look right down there in the description. This is the actual kit. You can see I've been using it. Okay? You get the hot pink nasty bin hook. You get the 132nd non-painted. You get the chartreuse. Okay? You get the chartreuse nasty bin hook, plus you get the 116. Um, all of them number four, plus you get my the, the same exact colors that you're watching me use right now. Black, red, and chartreuse. That pink, white, and chartreuse for muddy water. That black uh, chartreuse and green and also the red white and chartreuse everything comes in this water resistant carrying case okay plus the rod and reel for example with my finance company if you go get let's say you log on and you put this in your cart and you want to go through my finance company let's say this is a hundred dollars you go and check out like you normally do with your credit card and your debit card you put this in your cart and check out you'll see a powder blue button that says afterpay when you see afterpay click on it it's going to take you to a third party site all that's due at checkout is $25, and your rod and reel and your plastics are shipped to you immediately. Two weeks later, another payment is due. Two weeks later, another payment is due. Two weeks after that, another payment is due. After that, you're finished. Once you get finished paying those four payments, guys, all you owe is $100. No interest. And you get to get on the water and yank immediately. Okay, so check it out. Go to camscrappyhole.com. Nobody else on YouTube is doing it. Nobody else in the world is, is giving you this type of stuff. Guys, I'm going to bat because you guys show me love. You give love where you get love. All right, let's get back up there while the rain stops. Let's see if we can have some more fun. Mm. Yank! There he is. Guys, that pink, white, and chartreuse. A two. And let me say this. Let me tell you what I, what I did. It's summertime, as I mentioned to you before. Boy, he just stuck me with that hook. It's summertime. So you have to lower your print in the water. I'm not feeding them a, a two inch, okay, um, plastic. This is just a 1.5. Just by doing that in vertical chicken, look, he's been up there fighting, okay? He's a little old rascal. We're gonna let you go, big boy. We're just gonna film you for Instagram and then we're gonna let you go, okay? We're not gonna keep.
let me make check my jig and guys I fought tooth and nail to make sure that you guys were would not have a big sting at checkout let me turn you back around that you would not have a big sting at checkout that's why my finance company is there to assist you guys it's very simple all you guys just got to do is go to cams crappy hole checkout like you normally do and when you pull out your debit card or your credit card you'll see a powder blue button at checkout that says afterpay go in there and all you got to do is just do your normal stuff check out but you want to go through afterpay which is a third party site and they will set you up on payments no interest no credit okay no credit check and I'll give you up to six hundred dollars on your line of credit to spend inside my store and they break it up into four easy payments whoa come here big boy come here come here come here there you go wow come here big boy make sure you get that fish over the boat okay it's a nice crappie. It's a perfect eating size crappie. This is one I would take home to eat. That's the size that I like. Let me show them to you. That's a good eating size crappie. Man, they are ripping this tube apart. Let me say this. I also, and you'll see more of it when I go to my cutaway, I have my 9 foot and my 10 foot yank stick along with the plastics that I'm using right now, okay, in a combo kit. Nowhere else can you get that. Plus, you get the nasty bend hooks and you get it in a nice watertight resistant carrying case this is it right here matter of fact this is the exact same kit you can see how I'm, I'm using those plastics pink white chartreuse the green black and chartreuse for muddy water the red white and chartreuse and the black red and chartreuse plus you get the hot pink colored um, nasty bend hook 116 you get the non-painted and you get the chartreuse color jig head along with the 132nd non-painted guys all that comes to you free shipping plus afterpay you do you sit in the comforts of your own home do a couple of clicks Boom. I'm old school fishing with a cane pole. Okay? Let me put him in the basket. And for you guys out there thinking I'm going to take these fish home, don't worry. I'm not. Look, let me, let me, let me show you this. I'm going to have to replace this plastic jig. Look at that. They tore it up. Look at it. Look at it. I'm going to see if I can catch one more off of it. Then I'm going to have to replace it. Let me see if it'll stay up there. Oh, well, I don't know. Let's try one more. We don't have any luck. We're going to replace this rascal. There we go. Let's get back up there again. Look how far we drifted off. Okay, so we know they're hitting over here. Let's try over here on, on this side of the log. Make sure I got you guys next to me so you can see. Yank! Look at that time we set that bad boy in the water we weren't even ready did you see I was trying to get the camera together did you guys see that I was trying to get the camera together guys this is so simple all you're doing is just lowering the jig in the water and you'll feel that thumb that's it because Instagram is showing me so much love I'm gonna put him in the basket we're gonna release him real shortly Hold on, little rascal. Trick us off our game. I'm going to try on both sides. Don't assume anything. Yank! Don't assume anything. Don't assume anything. Okay? And, and one of the reasons why, guys, I keep coming back here and doing this, even though the fish aren't big big fish we're having a good time doing it look at this little rascal let me tell you something if you're in a lake and you're catching fish this size that's a healthy lake okay that's a healthy lake because this rascal here is going to turn into a 13 14 15 inch crappie we're going to let him go because he's a little bit too little to even keep a hold to let's see what happens over here remember that's that soft to the touch eva grip you get a cams reel and by the way the reel comes with the rod a six plus one ball bearing reel okay but you don't ever use it if you're using your 10-foot pole unless you're bank fishing okay I have had some people already purchased for that let's see if we can have a little bit of luck I'm coming in here I'm making all kind of noise too I'm 
making all kind of noise. Guys, do not let anybody trick you and tell you, talk you off your game saying you can't catch crappie in warm weather. Don't let nobody do that to you. You guys are sitting in the comforts of your own home and you're watching me pull crappie out. Yank! Look at that. He just hit it again. You guys are sitting there watching me do it. And all this stuff that you see is right down below this video. It's a hyperlink. All you got to do... All you have to do is just click the hyperlink and it'll take you right to that product to purchase. Let me get in here again. Let's see if we can have a little bit more luck. Look at that. Yank! <laughs> we got these little adolescents today, but man, we are having a ball. We got these little adolescents. Let's put him in there. <laughs> Let me show him to you. He's a little rascal. No reeling. You just pre-measure. Matter of fact, you can see my pole is at six feet. Let me show it to you. That's six feet. So I'm running about six and a quarter, six and a half right now. Let's pull on up a little bit more. There you guys. There you go. Yank! There he is. Guys, this is a great way to end this segment. <laughs> I want to say thank you guys so much for all the love and support that you guys have given me. Let me pull forward a little bit. Um, listen, take your kids out. Anytime that you see structure in the lake, they're holding crappie. They're definitely holding crappie. And take your kids out. You guys can see those nasty bin hooks. These things are world renowned now. They're not on trial anymore. Guys, we're the only ones that carry these nasty bin hooks, okay? Everything we have comes with free shipping, guys. I design them. I'm a fisherman. Nobody else comes out here and shows you guys in real time how to do this. Every single one of my products, you guys get a chance to just sit back in the comforts of your own home and watch me use them, okay? I'm using the exact same products that I ship to you guys. Two clicks, put it in your cart, check out, free shipping, plus afterpay, you got everything you want. Just go to camscrappyhole.com, and I want to say thank you guys so much for the love and support for all the five years. We got almost 200 segments on YouTube. We're on Instagram. We're on Facebook, Cam's Crappy Hole Community. We're on Cam's Crappy. We're on uh, Instagram, Cam, Cam's Crappy Hole Apparel. And all my love goes to YouTube. YouTube is, is my heavy lifting. You guys know me. My name is Cam. This is the Crappy Hole. Until next time, keep those hooks wet, keep those lines tight, and we'll see you on the next turn.